Yo, what is up guys? Welcome to the top 10 free non-member AC items in Adventure Quest Worlds. I'm going to give you guys a full list here with the wiki links in the description if you guys need more information on how to find these items. So let's take a look at what AC tagged items you guys can get for absolutely free in-game now. Coming in at the number 10 spot is the Evil Oversock Zeth Helm, which is available now from the AC shop in your game menu for zero ACs. I included this one in at number 10 because it is the new and we're not sure how long it's going to be in game for so just wanted to make sure that I was sticking that at the start of the video And it's a silly one, but it's not actually that bad looking I actually rock it on a few sets and it sounds ridiculous, but it looks cool at number nine We have the elite void that came out last week in adventure quest worlds personally one of my favorites on this list You can get this armor slash set by completing the quest chain at Citadel. the information for that will be linked in the Description down below if you guys can go check that out for yourself and grab that one too. coming in at number eight is the Scarlet Sorcerer. So this one's just a really nice, like clean, just simple looking armor, and it is dropped by Scarletta. Once again, this is zero AC tagged, non-member, and absolutely available for you guys to go get right now in game. All right then, guys. So moving on swiftly, coming in at the number seven spot is the Acrolof pet. There's not that many free AC pets in the game, and this one's been in the game for a while. But if you guys aren't aware, you can go get this by killing the Ultra Acrolof. Super big, giant, obnoxious pet. Whether you like it for the style or just annoying people. It is free non-member AC tag. So if you guys haven't got this one yet, go grab it, bank it, rock it, do whatever you want. It's a really cool looking pet. Coming in at number six is the Eternity Blade. Really cool looking actually. Really, really cool. This is a revamp of another blade. If you guys know what that blade is, let me know in the comment section down below. You can get this by completing the Eternity Blade quest chain in the Tower of Doom. Once again, all of that good stuff is linked down in the description for you guys to go check that out if you want to get this blade for yourself. Definitely one that I'm going to hop in and get after this video is finished and i'm probably gonna just put it in my bank because i I'm a, I'm a collector you know i like to have every item in the game so yeah eternity blade coming in at number six really nice looking all right then guys so switching up a bit for number five is the wee little aqw fan cape now some of you guys may not know this exists but this is actually available to anyone who finds a staff member in game and if a staff member is wearing the quote-unquote sister version of this cape which will have an exclamation mark above it you can click it you can open a shop and you can buy it for free it is zero ac tagged non-member once again guys just a side note i am a staff member of course so if you ever see me in game and you want this cape just let me know and i'll equip the cape and you guys can grab gotta subscribe though <laughs> i think guys so moving on to number four is the cinderez blade of shadows so how do you get the cinderez blade of shadows this sword was released a while ago and once again if you see someone wearing the cinderez blade cape then it will have an exclamation mark above and you guys can just click that it will open a shop and you can buy zero ac tagged cinderez blade of shadows Shadows right there and right there. I actually really like the style of this sword, which is why it's taken the top four spot. It's got that Doom Knight feel to it, which is something that I really like. Alright then, guys, so moving on to number three. But before we do that, I'd just like to say if you enjoyed this video so far, guys, or if I've helped you out at all, remember to hit that subscribe button, like this video, turn on those notification bells to be told when I post new content. Trust me, you don't want to miss it. Let's carry on. So at number three, we have the Blood Paladin. In other words, Z's old personal armor, which is why it's going in at number three. Definitely very, very desirable. Been in the game for a while, guys. Don't get me wrong, but I still haven't got it, so I think I might hop on and try and get it. But yeah, the Blood Paladin is coming in at number three, and you can get that. It's dropped by Lascivia. Once again, all the information you need is in the description, wiki links, anything you need. Really like the intricacy of this armor. It's so detailed, but it works. I'm usually one for really like plain and simple armors, but I love Z style, so Blood Paladin is coming in at number three. Let me know if you guys agree in the comment section down below, by the way. Okay, so moving on swiftly to number two, we have the Burn. Burning Blade of Abazif. <laughs> I think I'm saying that right. So the Burning Blade of Abazif. Why is this coming out number two? I know it's not the most attractive weapon, but you see so many people using it. And I, before I made this video, I was thinking why as well. Well, the reason why is because when you have this blade equipped, you get 30% more damage outgoing. This is free non-member AC tag once again, and is dropped by Aranx. It has a 5% drop chance, so you shouldn't be fighting too long. Let me know if you guys have this in the comment section down below. If you don't, let me know if you guys are gonna go bomb this. All right then guys, so coming in at the number one spot, 
spot for this video is an armor slash set that just got released very recently. It is the Void Battle Mage set from Lair Attack. Now, I know it's not like a super crazy one, but to me, it's just really cool that we get so many items free because they could have made a fortune out of this. I really like the style of this armor. When it first came out, I was like shocked that it was free. It's non-member AC tag, all that good stuff, and you guys can head into the game and get it now. I made a video on that one, guys. If you want to go check it out, I'll link it in the description too, just to give you guys some further guidance if the wiki link doesn't help you enough. With that being said, guys, that's all I have time for for today, but I really hope you have enjoyed this video. Let me know if I've been able to help you today, and from a list perspective, let me know if you agree with the way that I rank these. Of course, if you disagree with the way that I've listed these, please let me know in the comment section down below. I'd love to hear what you all have to say. Remember to subscribe, like, comment, and turn on those notification bells once again, guys, and I will see you so, so soon. Have an excellent day. Bye-bye.